Today I'm reviewing the Cosmic Ray Pickleball Paddle from Kasaka Sports. They were kind enough to send this along to me along with two other paddles to review. So I'll talk about the specifications and then give you my thoughts on the paddle. So this is an edgeless carbon fiber paddle. The paddle face is made of T700 woven carbon fiber. It's got a polypropylene honeycomb core. It's 16 and 5 16 long and 7 and 5 8 inches wide. It's got a 13 millimeter core. The paddle's going to come in around 8 ounces. I think this one was 8.1 ounces. The grip length is 5 and 1 8 inches and the grip circumference is 4 and a quarter inch. So like the other paddles from Kasaka, this one does come with a neoprene cover. All of their paddles came with a neoprene cover. That's always nice. It helps you protect the paddle when you're transporting it or moving it around. And it's pretty much par for the course for these leisure sport paddles that you're going to find on Amazon. So like the Rapid Fire, this particular paddle, it does have a bit of a durability issue, I think. I'll show you some of the issues that we've come across while playing with it. You can see here where the uh, coloring has chipped off of the paddle on the edges. Uh, in addition, the grit has worn down quite a bit. My daughter played with this paddle quite a lot. She did like playing with it, but she stopped playing with it because she, she felt like a buzz. It started buzzing in her hand. So uh, as far as durability is concerned, you don't expect this to last more than three to six months, depending on how much you play. Now, that could just be the models that we received, but... Um, depending on how much you play, how many games you play a week, that's going to uh, affect how any paddle lasts. As I mentioned with the Aero Swipe, the four and a half inch grip circumference is just too small for my hand. So if you have smaller hands, you may prefer this paddle, uh, but for me, it's just too small and I don't really like this ribbed grip that um, a lot of these leisure sport companies are, are putting on their pickleball paddles. So let's talk about the positives of this pa paddle. Obviously the price. A paddle that like this that's carbon fiber and edgeless 13 millimeter uh, it's priced between 60 and 90 dollars. That is extremely affordable. So if you're looking for a budget paddle this is a good option for you when you're moving up from that first paddle you may have bought off of Amazon or uh, at a department store. Uh, additionally, this paddle, again, like the others, doesn't feel slow in my hand, but it doesn't feel fast either. Uh, my gearbox feels way faster than this paddle. Uh, this particular one feels, a, it, you can see where the balance is on it here. So it's, it's a little head heavy, um, but some people like a head heavy paddle can help generate a little more power. So overall, this is a good paddle. It, nothing really stands out about the paddle. Again, the touch is gonna to be a little off compared to a, a premium paddle, but we're in the budget paddle market. Um, one of the good things is that they did get USA uh, Pickleball approval for this paddle. So it does meet those standards that you can use it in tournament play. So that does show that they're committed at least to uh, hitting those standards. So overall, this is a good paddle. Um, it's going to have some durability issues, but for the price range that it's in, it's in this budget leisure sport category. I think it's, it's just fine for that. If you're not looking to play in tournaments uh, pretty regularly, if you're just out playing for fun at your local courts, this is a good paddle for you. Or if you're looking to try out some of the thinner edgeless design paddles and you're kind of got sticker shock when you look at something like a gearbox this is a good step towards that to see if you're going to like it without dumping too much money uh, into a, a premium paddle so that's the kasaka cosmic ray and uh, once again i thank them for sending this there's a link in the description below if you want to pick it up uh, through amazon through an affiliate link thanks for watching i'll talk to you next time